Hi, welcome back to Fantastic 50s. Today I'm going to show you a delicious, cool summer treat to have that is healthy and just simply delicious to enjoy. This is my healthy homemade fudge sickles. So what you will need is cacao powder. Cacao powder is much healthier than cocoa powder. It's just less treated with heat. This is awesome. This is a health food. It has like five grams of fiber per serving, vitamin D, potassium, calcium, flavanols, uh, magnesium. It's just a super health food for two tablespoons. I will be using organic vanilla and cinnamon. Uh, this is optional. I use maple syrup to enhance this. If you don't want it real sweet, just stick to your stevia or xylitol. Uh, this is a little bit of sea salt. Again, salt really brings the flavors together. It will be bland without a little bit of salt, and that is to your taste buds. You can decide how much chocolate you want, uh, how much sweetness, and how much salt, but you need all of that for this recipe. So I, oh, and we have our coconut cream. I like coconut cream better than the milk. It, it does give it a fudgier, creamier consistency. So this is how we'll start. I'll do a whole can of coconut cream. And you gotta be careful with it because it's kind of solid, but when you punch through that, it's liquidy. So don't let that just come spilling out. So we'll help that into the container. Very good. I'll use my clean fingers. <laughs> I'm gonna add two, I'm gonna start off with two tablespoons. This is pretty rich, so that might be all of the chocolate you want. Again, adjust all of this to your taste buds. And I just kind of sprinkle in, I don't measure my cinnamon, I just do a little shake like that. And I am actually going to use this whole thing of salt. And I'll go ahead and put two of the stevia in before I add my maple syrup just because I want to taste the sweetness before I add that. And that's two tablespoons in there that I measure. But again, just adjust it to how you like it. So this is really just awesome on these hot summer days and nights when you just want a little treat and you don't want to just have a bunch of junk. This is actually health food. So you can enjoy it without feeling guilty. I use a mixer for this because it will really whip up the, the cream nicely to, to just give it that real creamy consistency after we freeze it. I'm going to taste this and see where we're at with the sweetness. Okay, that's, that's good, but I'm gonna add one more tablespoon of my powder, chocolate powder, cacao powder. And I am going to, I am gonna add this whole thing in there because for the amount of servings, this will not be a lot of sugar per serving. And maple syrup, when you get pure maple syrup, this has magnesium and iron and calcium in it. How amazing is that? Oh yeah. So that is looking nice and pudding-like. Okay, so you have two options. You can use some little dishes like this, which I will do both just to show you how they each will turn out. So this will just set up in the refrigerator for just, you know, maybe an hour, if that. Now I have these neat little molds, so you can uh, have a fudgy popsicle, or fudge sickle, whatever I said it was. Yeah, I think I'm only gonna get like three out of this, just for demonstrations purposes. 
And let's not waste this. Let's get it all in there. A little messy. And you put the little lid on this. These will go in the freezer for about four hours. Uh, the little cups will go in the refrigerator for 30 minutes to an hour. So check back with me and I'll show you the results. All right, so we're back. These are set up. I did put some raspberries and fresh mint sprigs. That, of course, is optional, but that always makes it pretty and gives you even more fiber and antioxidants. And these are the pops. They do have a sheath on them, so of course before you eat them you take the sheath off, but they come out just like that and they are super delicious and yummy. Alright, so if you enjoyed this delicious recipe and you'd like to see more recipes like this, please hit like and subscribe and comment down below. And you have a great rest of your summer and stay cool. Hey, like Isaac on the love boat. I'm corny, I know. Bye!